In 2021, we started concepting out a fantasy MMO called Mirandus. Our vision was to create a different experience, one that's easier to play, brings adventure back with high stakes, offers an unpredictable world with living enemies, and allows for player-owned content. We set out to achieve this and discovered we weren't alone in our quest. There is a vast audience of gamers around the world who are excited to experience a true adventure. We also decided to share the adventure of making Mirandus with the community. We brainstorm designs and share internal builds called tech tests. Our initial community tech test was a rudimentary experience, featuring simple assets that allowed players to move around and test the concept's potential appeal and fun. We prototyped a basic outpost where players could harvest, make bread, run around a rough idea of a forest. Despite the absence of foundational gameplay mechanics, our aim was to create a small experience that would be enticing to explore. To conclude the year, we prototyped some single-player mechanics and tested our multiplayer functionality. The single-player zone let you walk around a larger area than previous tests and get a sense of what exploration might feel like. We prototyped an enemy and got our first glimpse of what evil might look like in the world. The multiplayer test took place in a castle courtyard. We used this zone to prove out our network foundations before moving on to world building and other complex game systems. Okay, everyone jump if you were a Galibers. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! yes! <laughs> we restructured the tech stack, taking into account all of the lessons we learned from previous tech tests. We also initiated a complete art overhaul, opting for a more immersive and beautiful style. Our focus was on testing the performance of the new art style and how the new server communicates with projectiles triggering hits, damage, and death messages between servers. While it was a simple tech test, it demonstrated the potential of the new direction. Our latest playable will feature a much larger play area, 30 times larger than our previous Goblin Meadows tech test. Our goal for Mirandus is to set the scene and allow players to explore the world. The stage is set, and it's up to players to survive their first journey. We've assembled an elite team of senior game developers responsible for some of the most well-known titles in the industry, and they've established the engineering, art, and design foundations for Mirandus' first test adventure. This will be accompanied via a full-size zone complete with exploration, combat, and crafting. Players will need to gather resources to upgrade their gear, preparing them to take on supernatural creatures. There is a scourge in the land that players can only defeat if they're adequately equipped possess the necessary skills, and know how to work together. While there is still a lot to develop, some of the cores stood up. We're excited to share this progress with our fans, and as usual, we could use your help playing and helping us stress test. One thing of note, our fans on Discord have a saying, hashtag make Mirandus hard. This latest playtest is tuned to be very difficult. It requires you to work in groups and approach danger with extreme caution, because if you die, you do have to start your adventure all over again.